New York City is full of just the most amazing foods and today we're gonna to take a look at burgers with more and more and more amazing burgers popping up. How could I contain it to just one video? So here are four more New York City burgers you need to be eating. Let me tell you why. Inside of the Arlo Soho Hotel is Linden's and this insane double smash burger. You guys know I'm very into smash right now. On each patty goes a slice of white American cheese. I mean, cheese. It's then stacked into a bun with a special burger sauce, grilled red onions, and a cherry pepper relish. You just get like perfect layers of fat with that beef of that cheese. And then to counter that, you have that relish and a little bit of sweetness from the onions. Just like all flavors coming together in one mm, good bite. Oh my God. Greg Braxton of Olmsted fame has a brand new restaurant, Five Acres, inside of Rockefeller Center, serving this unreal burger, which begins with two brisket patties uh, being seared on cast iron. Toast alongside that is a house-made brioche bun. Once the patties are flipped, um, they're topped with red onions and two slices of roquette cheese. While that finishes in the oven, uh, in this bubbling pot of veal choux, soaks a slice of that same brioche. That's in place on top of the burger. Just wow. Not done yet, let's talk about those hand cut french fries that are served alongside with a, wait for it, oh my god, foie gras hollandaise. This burger's crazy. I mean, it smells just unbelievable. Oh man. That is so rich. <laughs> oh my God. Mm. I'm like trying to find the words, but I can't. Having that soaked bun in the middle with that jus is just like an intense punch of flavor in the middle of that whole bite. Oh my God. Nice little sweetness in those red onions, great fat and salt going on in the middle of the burger too. Oh my God. This is wild. Mmm. 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 I'm also excited for this Foie Hollandaise. Hello. Never heard of that. Let's get in there. Ooh. Yo. The texture that they got out of that foam is like so light and so airy. Mmm. It's a great mouthfeel while being, again, a super rich, insane. Mm, you know what I want, though? Let's dip that burger into that flop. Ooh. Ooh. Mmm. Oh, that's it right there. Oh, my God. This burger is for burger lovers. You need to love that beef. You need to love those deep, rich flavors happening in there. <clears throat> and I love a burger. <clears throat> oh my, oh my, oh my. Inside the Fire Dye Urban Space is extra sauce, which is serving just unreal burgers, fried chicken sandwiches, and more. I got two of their burgers. Uh, they both start with two smash patties on the griddle. Super thin being topped with the best American cheese until it's all melty melty. The classic burger then goes on like butter and toasted potato bun with their Brooklyn sauce, onions, and pickles. But then the signature smash goes onto a bun toasted with butter, garlic, and parm. That's topped with a gochujang aioli and miso caramelized onions. Mm, that crispy crust they got on the burger is so freaking nice. Mm. Where's perfectly like all those layers of fat going on there. It just like levels and levels and levels and textures and flavors and blah blah blah. Oh my god. Whew. 
That feels good. That feels very, very, very good. Oh, fuck. Mmm. That was just like a thousand flavors hitting me at once. Jesus. Mmm. I went goji shang aioli on everything. On everything. I mean, the garlic, parmesan, butter on there. The fat from the burger, the fat from the American cheese. Nice little sweetness coming from those onions, too. Oh my god. Dude, no, you like have to eat this burger. Have to eat this burger. Oh, Jesus. Mm. Fort Charles Prime Rib is one of the hardest reservations in New York City. And this double Wagyu cheeseburger, which is griddled and pressed alongside American cheese, pickles, and Dijon, is a big reason why. You don't need it, but you can also add that egg and thick of bacon to it as well. Just such a dreamy bite. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you like this, a sub would be great. I go on a lot of food adventures. And here are some other videos that you might enjoy. Amazing food.